Hey guys, Coach Des here for Monday's workout briefing. Monday's workout is called Muscle Beach. This is one of two greens, um, like benchmark workouts, so we might see this one repeated. So if tomorrow's a rest day, I would strongly encourage you make this one up on Sunday if you're able to. Um, the workout starts off with a warm up. It's three rounds of 10 scat push ups, 10 dive bomb push ups, 10 scat pull ups, 10 empty bar bicep curls, and 10 tuck ups. Those dive bomb push ups are where you're like up in a pike and you dive down into your normal push up. And when you push back up, you kind of push back. I'll see if I can find a video. Lucas does them well with sound effects. If you need a demo, you might go to him. I'll see if I can find a video online of them. Um, but it's a little different than a pike push up, but similar kind of range of motion. Um, strength is gonna be 16 minutes to build to a one rep max floor press. So that's laying on the floor obviously and doing it from the rack. Um, just like how you would set up a bench press. Um, on this one, still important to have people gripping a full grip on the bar. Make sure that thumb is wrapped around, but it is a little bit less risky than a heavy bench press because if you fail and you can't get up, like the bar will stop before it chokes you, which is kind of nice. But you can also have people like take turns so that they can have a spotter for it too. That wouldn't be a bad idea. The wad is a 10 minute AMRAP of 20 push ups. 15 plate sit-ups and 10 strict pull-ups. On the plate sit-ups tomorrow, I'd like to see the plate just like on your chest so we're not able to use that shoulder movement to really pull yourself forward because that makes it a lot easier. So just taking the plate to your chest and just sitting up with it. They don't necessarily have to have it touch the ground, but they can um, just sit up with it, get the shoulders in front of the hips and lay back down. That way we're not really almost getting like a kip to our sit up where we're really using our shoulders to help propel us upward. This is really a strength focused wad. Um, and then 10 strict pull ups. So like I said, it's strength focused. So instead of people scaling strict pull ups by doing kipping, I'd rather see them grab a band or grab, um, a set of rings, whatever it takes to get them doing a more vertical pull, unless of course, for some reason they have an injury that prevents them from doing that. Um, picking something different spine. A lot of times if people have shoulder problems, they can't do like a banded pull up, but they can do a ring row. So that's always an option. Bent over rows are a good substitution as well. Then the cool down is a scorpion stretch and a cobra stretch. So um, that's pretty much it for today. You guys know the drill on floor presses. Those aren't new to us anymore, but if you have any questions, drop them in the comments on Slack and I'll get back to you. Have a good week guys.